Welcome back to another video tutorial by Darren at TV Box Company, formerly Cody TV Boxes. .co.uk. This is just going to be a quick demonstration of how you exit Cody um, or SBMC. Uh, basically, if you're locked up or if you're frozen, now what I would say is you can appreciate this isn't going to be frozen because I'll, I'm not holding it, but it's, uh, but generally speaking, this is caused by bad live links. Now, I'm not actually 100% sure what causes the problem, but on the odd occasion, you can leave it for half an hour and sometimes it doesn't correct itself. So what I would say, if it freezes, i.e. you press return on your remote, I'm going to keep pressing return, don't keep pressing it, and you know, just press it once, if it doesn't return, press the stop button if you've got a stop button on your remote, and if that doesn't still work, excuse me, just leave it, um, leave it there, just give it five minutes, I'm going to sort of rush into doing this. Um, but obviously any more than five minutes you, you've obviously got a problem now it may not have happened to you but it will most probably at some point in your Cody sort of um, career if you like um, it will happen at some point so just be wary of this now the obvious thing to do most people just pull the power now the problem with doing that is it can actually corrupt your operating system if the box is rooted now I don't really think you suffer with this much on Windows or anything like that it's generally an Android problem um, as I'm aware of anyway. Now this is actually going to demonstrate it on an Android box. So for argument's sake, if this is frozen now, obviously it's not as I said, um, you're going to press the stop button. If that doesn't work, if it just keeps spooling as well, sometimes it can spool for hours and not ask to do anything, press the return button and the stop button and wait for five minutes as I've said. If that doesn't cure it, um, obviously you can come down here and press anything else, it's not going to work. So what you do is press the home button on your remote control and that will actually take you back to your Android operating system okay now as I say this will work on Kodi and SBMC and it doesn't matter if what version of um, Android operating system you're running this for example is on 4.4.2 if you're on 5.1.1 it's going to be very similar the actual launcher and the icons may look different but you're going to be very very similar now it may say um, settings, it may say system, it depends on the box, but you're going to be very, very similar. So just bear that in mind. So once you press the home button and get back to the screen, you simply click into settings, into other. Again, it's going to be very similar if it's not set, if it's not exactly the same correct terminologies. And then you want more settings. Basically, we're after this black screen. Once you get to here, click on apps. Now, whichever app you want to force close, in this case, we're demonstrating it on SBMC. So we're going to click into there. Now we're going to click force stop. Now, I'm going to click OK to that. Now, by doing that, that's not going to corrupt your operating system in any way, shape, or form. However, if you just pull the power, there is a possibility it could have um, obviously corrupted your operating system. So just bear that in mind. And one other thing. It, it would be my advice at this stage to reboot your box. Now, the only reason I say that is on the odd occasion, if you haven't, uh, if you go into it too quickly, um, the, the box will crash back to the home screen. It'll only do it once, but it does do it. Now, to avoid that, to avoid thinking there's problems, I would recommend you do a, a reboot. Now, for the demonstration purposes, obviously I'm recording on the box, so it's a little bit more difficult. So we're going to click into here anyway now, and you'll see that that's just like basically you're just running a new run now. Um, it shouldn't, well, it's not going to crash box, but once we get the spinning Cody, it's not going to crash back. There we go. So, just bear that in mind, guys. Just wanted to just demonstrate that. Thumbs up if it's helped you. Um, please remember, though, that uh, just pulling the power out and, and whatever is going to cause you or could cause you problems. So, just, just follow that little tutorial and, and that will help you loads. I'm going to leave it there. Thanks for watching and uh, catch you on the next one.